Yo, what's going on everybody? My name's Dusk and we're here with another Horizon Zero Dawn video and yeah, we're just gonna be playing through another mission and yeah, just playing it. Let's do this. I'm wearing my hood because it's like freezing cold inside my house right now, so yeah, it's keeping me warm. As you can see, I got my Astro A40 headset on. I freaking love this thing, okay? They're so nice. It just makes the experience of playing games so awesome when you wear a, a really high quality headset and you can hear the audio really well. Whoa, this is cool. This is like a huge arena where they like fight them or something. It's like where the Romans had gladiator fights down there. <laughs> like, look at that. All right, so we're here doing this mission and uh, I'm not 100% sure what we're even really doing. This mission is supposed to explain to us exactly all about and like what Zero Dawn is. So let's see if it actually does. Yo, I like your hat, bro. This is crazy. We got to jump across this. Yo, Aloy girl, you be doing some crazy things, but I'm down. Oh, I just shit. That didn't work. I totally did not do that right. It's all good. We can climb back up, I, I think. Oh, yeah, we can. Oh, we're supposed to be going down anyways. I've shown you the way in, but this humble vent marks a point of no return. Before you descend to the depths here, you should be fully committed, equipped, and focused. I am. No distractions. All right, I'm down. Let's do this. Let's open it. Let's do it. Yo, this must be like something seriously bad or like, or just something I'm intense. Down. I've spent a lifetime trying to uncover the secrets of this world. Dang. Where the machines came from, how the old ones achieved such marvels only to fall into silence and death. A lifetime of failure as year by year, decade after decade, I hit walls I could not break, doors Oh, it's I another one of these doors. Until a Nora Huntress marched out of the savage east and voila. Oh, I suspect awesome. you'll have an easier time with this door than I did years ago. We know how to open these doors, don't oh, we, Aloy? Right into scan. Should just let us right in. Genetic profile confirmed. Yes. Entry authorized. Malfunction. Malfunction. No. Malfunction. That's not what we want to hear. You don't hear me laughing. Shut up. There's gotta be another way. Hey, Elizabeth Sobek here, requesting access. Access request acknowledged. Root command functions available. Do you wish to proceed? I do! Get me through this door! Analyzing. Primary access inoperable due to mechanical failure. Emergency oh, no. venting procedure likely to circumvent blockage. Do you wish to proceed? Yes. Do it. Yes. Emergency venting authorized. Yo, this door is high tech. Who? Oh, we're through. We are through. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Everybody's gonna know we're down here now. Let's get what we came for and let's Welcome get out of here. Project Zero Dawn. Oh, this is Zero where Dawn. Zero Dawn actually happened. We found it. So Zero Dawn is what so saved us, uh, the human race, from the like machine dinosaurs in the first place. So the machine, you know, just animals. We're here to try to figure out what exactly it was and how they defeated them the first time. That way we can do it this time. Initiating playback. Uh oh, something's gonna go crazy. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Welcome to Project Zero Dawn. I am General Harris. Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the United States of America. I'm sure you've heard the rumors that Zero Dawn is a top secret super weapons program. The technological yep. miracle that will save us from the Pharaoh Plague if Operation Enduring Victory can hold off the robots long enough. The reason I'm sure you've heard the rumors is that I'm the one who spread them. And they are all lies. Zero Dawn is not a super weapons program. And it will not save us. Wait, what? Nothing will save us. And here's why. By the time the glitch was noticed, it was already too late. Nothing could stop the Pharaoh Plague. Nothing can. Its robots will continue to replicate and devour the biosphere. Life on Earth will be destroyed. Our planet reduced to a barren sphere. Oh no. Global extinction is inevitable. No matter how many we kill, the robots just keep exponentially making more. If we had their deactivation codes, we how could we shut made them it all this down. Far, then? The entire swarm. But since their cryptographic protocols use polyphasic entangled waveforms, cracking a code set would take half a century. At best, we've got 16 months. Not exactly what you'd call a survival option. 
The destruction of a biosphere is not the sort of apocalypse you can wait out in a fallout shelter or a space station. There will be no Earth left to reclaim. Just a lifeless, toxic rock with several million pharaoh robots on it. Hibernating. Jeez. That Ready sounds like to eat. hell. This is the horrible truth behind the lies of Operation Enduring Victory. My lies. Lies designed to inspire millions of innocents to sacrifice themselves in battle. Why? One reason. To buy time for you and the work you will do here. Zero day. The day that life on Earth ceases to exist oh, is no. coming fast. It cannot well, be stopped. The hope of Zero Dawn is that something new might come after. But I will leave it to Elizabeth Sobek to shine that thin ray of light into the darkness. Harris, out. You know, life on Earth hasn't ended, so I'm, I'm confused because I thought we were like a thousand years after that or something. Life on Earth didn't cease to exist. Yeah, yeah, see? He said it could not be stopped. But it was. Somehow, somehow Elizabeth saved us. Wait, hold on. If it moves, If they could just get in here through the vents, then why did we have to go through the huge door? Dude, silent strikes are my favorite way to take out enemies. For real. Whoa, what do you have, dude? Oh my gosh, that's crazy. I'm using this thing. Die, die. Dude, just die. Stop shooting at me with that freaking... I don't even know what that is. The fire spitter, I think it's called. That thing's crazy. Like, shoots like little missile rockets. Yeah, 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 get some, get some, take it. You like that, don't you? Oh, he's too easy. He, he is not even going to get a good shot off on me. And let's finish him. Elizabeth Sobek. You've heard the bad news, and it's all true. The Pharaoh Plague is devouring the biosphere. Life itself will cease to exist. But does that have to be the end? I hope not. What if we could give life a future? What if we could build a kind of seed from which, on a dead planet, life could blossom anew? This is the aim, the hope, of Project Zero Dawn. To create Whoa. a super intelligent, fully automated terraforming system and bring life back from lifelessness. Yo, that is what not what I expected, require? but that's clever. At its core, it would need a true AI, fully capable of making the trillions of decisions necessary to reconstitute the biosphere. An immortal guardian, devoted to the reflourishing of life. We call it Gaia. Mother Nature as an AI. But Whoa. that's just the core of the system. She will need to be surrounded and empowered by a comprehensive suite of subordinate functions. Think of them as extensions of Gaia's mind. This is insane. Each dedicated to a specific purpose. Apollo. Now these aren't AIs, but make no mistake. Poseidon. Each presents an engineering challenge more profound than anything the human species has ever before attempted. This is insane. Hardware that preserves and then gestates the billions of seeds and embryos from which life will be reborn. The construction of underground facilities to hold it all. And that's just the start. We don't have to build the entire system. The beauty of a fully automated terraforming system is that it can build itself. How we'll lock it down and seal it up before the inevitable occurs. But even more important, you'll know how it doesn't end here. How Gaia will generate those deactivation codes General Harris talked about. And build the transmission arrays to broadcast them, shutting down the feral robots for good. Gaia will not just build, but imagine any conceivable robot it needs to do its work across centuries. From detoxifying the Earth's ravaged atmosphere and poisoned seas, to the regreening of the Earth from cryopreserved seed stocks, to rewilding the Earth with animal life. And then, when all that is done, how a new generation of human beings spawned at cradle facilities. So some of the, the robots globe, are actually part of, of Zero Dawn? The vast archive of human knowledge and cultural achievement from which they will learn of us, our world, and most important, how not to repeat our mistakes. It's not an impossible dream. It is within our grasp if we work tirelessly and stop at nothing to achieve it. Whoa. We can't stop life from ending. But if you will help me, help Gaia, 
we can give it a future. Join me and help make that future real. The whole earth destroyed, but then remade. So that's what she said. This is crazy. I had no idea. That's what Zero Dawn was. I always thought it was some kind of like weapon Intruder. or disease. It's crazy because it turns out that some of the robots that we see on a regular basis are actually part of Zero Dawn to help rebuild the Earth. That's crazy. Yeah, get some, bro. You like that? You don't like when I'm shooting back at you, do you? Oh, it's another one of these puzzle things I gotta do. So this one is over, up, over, down. Turn that one like that. Leave you. Turn you that way. This one needs to go down, and this one needs to go over like that. Now that should be doing. There we go. It was this door right over here, right? Yeah. This door's open now. What is that? Is that the part I'm, I'm missing? Oh, I can go across this. Sweet. It's a cool little area. Huge supply crate full of a ton of stuff too. That's what I like to see. Missing a part. This is the part it's missing. Let's install that part real quick. This one goes down. This one goes over. Wait, that's right. Wait, what? Have you been lying to me, Code? Hey, I'm done with Brett's incompetence, okay? Somehow, he managed to install an H emitter node backwards. Everything's in reverse. Oh, okay. I thought I was doing something wrong. Good thing I freaking listened to that. So apparently the whole code is backwards, so I need to do it instead of from top to bottom, from bottom to top. Let's do that, and then it should work. Everything's hella backwards, so if it's that way, it's really this way, right? Oh, shit. Everything's like hella backwards, so if this one's up, this one's really down. This puzzle is actually confusing. Down, okay, even though it's up. Man, this... Seriously, this one's confusing, but this should be it. All right, I got it. Holy crap, finally. I'm taking this with me. <laughs> no matter what's on the other side of that, I'm gonna have this big ass gun to help me out when I get there. What, how is there already dudes in here? I just went through so much just to get in here. So much for avoiding contact. Guy is in here? Okay, okay. I'm down to do some killing. I just gotta go open fire on him. Just kill him as fast as we can. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? It locked my big gun on the other side of the door. How rude. There's one. Yeah, you ain't got nothing on me. Oh, look how many more of them are coming. Oh, no. And die. Come on. Get some. See that shot? Dude, that was like sniper shot with a bow. Cannot tell me I'm not good with this. Oh, look at that. Oh, headshot. Oh, you guys are all screwed now. Oh, look at that. Look how much that just, just destroys them. Holy crap. Any robot she needs for any conceivable purpose designed and fabricated at a snap of a finger. Yo, so basically that room right there is where Gaia made all the robot animals she chose to make. The AI guy could just make any type of robot it wanted, whenever it wanted. Like, that's crazy. No wonder we have so many crazy animals and robots roaming the lands. Wait, so if Gaia actually said it was gonna make humans, so are you saying that there's a chance Aloy isn't completely like human? She doesn't have a mother because she wasn't actually born? She was made? Wait, hold on. What? Yo, this is crazy. This whole storyline's taking a turn in a direction I did not expect. But now I really want to know. Pry it open, pry it open, pry it open, girl. Oh, yeah. Open that. All right, we're in. Dr. Sobek's office. Oh, this is a big supply crate. I think I will take everything in it. What do you got over here? Access. The registry master file. Intact? Yeah. No signs of corruption. How does she even know? For? She's never seen anything like this file. before. With this... I can restore the registry at the hatch inside all mother. Open it. Go inside. And grasp the secrets within. Yes, let's do that. Where I was born. Maybe. Maybe who gave birth to me. Who? Are you really so naive? There will be no who waiting for you there, Aloy. Whatever birthed you into the world was a what not a who. Oh you my gosh. Oh no, I had a legitimate. She's birth. not even human. It's a you, Aloy. Or the creation of a machine, but what kind of machine and why? Why were you created? Whoa! This is crazy! No wonder she's such a badass. She was created by a machine. Okay, we got a lot of Eclipse coming in. Eclipse. You need to get out of there. What you found is too valuable. You're too valuable. Oh, that's a big one. Yo, he looks crazy! <laughs> what is that? Oh no, it's gonna blow up. Whoa! Yo, dude, what's up? Still alive. Good. I have a more suitable death in mind for you, child. Ooh. Your focus. Such a powerful device, isn't it? And yet, so fragile. Yo, what is this crazy situation I'm in now? 
Do I have to fight in this ring? Oh no. I'm like a gladiator. Let this one who schemed and slithered be the first to die. Oh my gosh, I have to fight all three of these things? Yo, what am I supposed to do? Yeah, you like that? You don't like that very much, do you, boy? Yo, I'm actually beating him. Look at his health. It's actually pretty low. This thing is crazy. Did you see that? Dude, that was so cheap. Oh, I beat him. I actually killed him. Oh, my God. Yes, dude. Yes. Yes, dude. Look at you. You ain't so tough when you're on the ground dead, are you? Look at him. Look at his face. He doesn't even know what to think. Oh, crap. I still got to kill those two things. Kill her. Oh, here we go, two more. Oh no, this is not good. Yo, what just happened? Yo! This is the first time I've actually seen him in real life. Yes! What a badass! He comes to save me! Silence, you're such a badass! I never liked him before, but now he's such a badass. Oh, and you brought backup? Yo, you are the man! Oh yeah, dude. This game is so badass! Oh, look, I'm just destroy those. That was the best mission of the game yet so far. Dude, that was awesome. Yeah. And silence is off. All right, anyways, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, leave me a like or a comment or both. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day or night or whenever you're watching this. And like always, I'm Dusky M. Later. Goddamn, goddamn, you be sexy, girl. Looking at your body and I know you make my world. Goddamn, goddamn, the way you move your hips. Every way you move your body sends me on a fucking trip. Goddamn, goddamn, you be sexy, girl. Looking at your body and I know you make my world.